Mobileye. Top 10 Comfortable Sports Bikes You Can Actually Ride Daily Sports bikes are considered the worst segment to aim for if you're looking for a comfortable daily rider, but these sports tours are different. Motorcycles provide a thrill that many people term as indescribable. Feeling the wind in your hair and being one with the road are some of the first things that pop into anybody's head while thinking of getting a motorcycle. If you ask veteran bikers what are the key factors to consider before settling on your ideal ride, comfort and practicality are the two factors that top their list. Comfort is achieved by the assembly of the motorcycle by the manufacturer. Practicality, on the other hand, is quite diverse. It ranges from how much weight you can haul on your bike, fuel consumption, and availability of parts to mention a few. 10. Suzuki GSX-S 1000F With Supersport engraved on its DNA, the Suzuki GSX-S 1000F is one of the best sports bikes available in the market today. Sitting under the Suzuki GSX-S 1000F's beautifully crafted body is a street-tuned four-stroke, liquid-cooled, DOHC, 999 cubic centimeters, inline-four engine. The GSX-S 1000F is also fitted with modern technology that offers balanced advanced controls. The Suzuki GSX-S 1000F traction control system allows the rider to control the throttle allowing for a relaxed and enjoyable ride. While it is built to look aggressive, this motorcycle is comfortable and practical. The wild, rugged, and aggressive looks are a big plus for this tamed beast. 9. Ducati Super Sport When listing sports bikes, the Ducati never misses on the list. Ducati is one of the contenders for the ultimate sports bikes king and at the pace that their bikes are evolving, they might be closer to the throne. The Ducati Super Sport blends power, comfort, and reliability, making it a good choice for a daily driver as well as a track bike. This motorcycle is powered by the Ducati Testastrata 11 degrees 937 cubic centimeters engine that pushes 110 horsepower at 9000 rpm and it delivers 9.5 kgm of torque at 6500 rpm. The Ducati Supersport is also fitted with a comfortable seat that guarantees comfort for long rides. 8. Kawasaki Z1000SX the Kawasaki Z1000SX falls between the Ninja ZX-10R and the Naked Z1000. With this bike, Kawasaki was looking to build a new line that was not overshadowed by their other sports bike lines. The Kawasaki Z1000SX is built to be comfortable, easy to ride, and adaptable for racing. The Z1000SX is powered by a 1,043 cubic centimeters inline four engine that pushes 138 horsepower at 9,600 RPM and delivers 110 Newton meters at 7,800 RPM. For the rider's comfort, Kawasaki fitted an adjustable windscreen, chain drive, adjustable rear shocks, and a comfortable dual seat. 7. BMW R1250RS the BMW R1250RS is an upgrade of the R1200RS that first arrived in 2015, built around the German manufacturer's 125-horsepower liquid-cooled twin-cylinder engine. This is a bike that's so much more than just the sum of its parts, offering plenty of power, excellent handling, and superb touring capabilities, all wrapped up in a comfortable package. In 2019, the bike became the significantly uprated R1250RS with the new shift cam 1250 engine producing 135 horsepower. It also received a new TFT dash and fresh styling, including an adjustable screen. The base bike can now be used for pretty much all types of riding, from the daily commute to continent crossing adventures, especially once it's loaded up with some BMW accessories. 6. Kawasaki H2SX Kawasaki motorcycles are among the most popular bikes around the world among new riders. The Kawasaki H2SX is a perfect balance of luxury, performance, and comfort. 
This tamed beast is powered by a 998 cubic centimeters four-cylinder supercharged engine that delivers more than average power. Considered a high-performance sports bike, the Kawasaki H2SX makes for a good daily driver for anyone who fancies speed on a daily. The Kawasaki H2SX's seat is made to fit a maximum of two people, the rider and a passenger. It was also built to absorb the motorcycle's vibrations and give the rider a comfortable trip. 5. Yamaha FJR1300 The Yamaha FJR1300 is one of Yamaha's flagship sports touring bikes. This motorcycle is built with modern technology that features electronic suspension, traction control, cruise control, and LED cornering headlights. The FJR1300 makes the ideal daily rider option. It is powered by a 1,298 cubic centimeters liquid-cooled, 16-valve, DOHC inline four-cylinder engine. This engine is paired with a six-speed multi-plate assist and slipper wet clutch that provides an even space gearing. The push-button adjustable windscreen, adjustable ergonomics, and plush rider and passenger seat make the FJR1300 a comfortable rider. 4. KTM 1290 Super Duke GT The KTM 1290 Super Duke GT is a high-tech hooligan bike that just happens to be excellent at both daily riding duties and long road trips. KTM quite literally created a sports tourer by bolting a fairing onto the super naked 1290 Super Duke. The bike has also been loaded with some serious high-end components, such as WP semi-active suspension, a plethora of rider aids and riding modes, cornering ABS, you name it. With 175 horsepower, this bike will get you to your destination in no time, whether it's the office or across a continent. While it doesn't have huge fairings to protect the rider from the elements, it's still surprisingly comfortable and practical. 3. Honda VFR 800R The Honda VFR 800F is pretty much the textbook definition of a user-friendly sport touring motorcycle. It's been around for decades, and Honda has pretty much perfected the formula by now. It's a great daily rider, the perfect touring companion, and sporty enough to be a hoot in the twisty sections. Being a Honda, it's also virtually bulletproof, and the 782 cubic centimeters V4 engine delivers impressive performance with 105 horsepower and 55 lbft of torque. The VFR might look sporty, but the real trick up its sleeve is that it's extremely comfortable to ride and supports good body posture. 2. Triumph Sprint ST1050 Ever since the Triumph Sprint ST was released, it has slowly, but surely, chipped away at the Honda VFR 800's market share. And for good reason, it's fast, practical, reliable, and very comfortable. We should perhaps also mention that it's a true bargain when we consider what you get for your money. Unfortunately, the Sprint ST disappeared from the market in 2011, but if one comes up for sale, you might want to seriously consider snatching it up. Those who need more convincing might be more inclined to buy one when they learn that it's powered by Triumph's 1050 cubic centimeters three-cylinder engine, which also happens to be the unit that powers the iconic Speed Triple and Tiger. In 2010, there was also a Sprint GT1050 version, which was more pillion-friendly and slightly better at long-distance touring. 1. Suzuki SV-1000 The Suzuki SV-1000 took the engine from the old TL-1000S and has a claimed power figure of 120 horsepower, in reality, it's a little lower, but that's easily sorted out with an air filter, exhaust system, and power commander. The SV-1000 disappeared off the market back in 2007, so you'll have to buy a used model. However, they're cheap as chips and can be found for a couple of thousand dollars. If you do decide to get one, the fared Suzuki SV-1000S version has lower bars but is definitely a better all-rounder than its completely naked sibling. This bike is perfect for everyday commuting, touring, and even track days. What more could we possibly ask for?
I hope to inspire you and help you learn more about your favorite theme. Subscribe to my channel and let me know what you think.